It's the wisdom driven. It's the experience driven. In the past, it's the knowledge driven, and it's the manufacturing driven, and in the future, it's the creativity driven. I think next to 30 years, the world is going to change a lot. The new technology is going to change every aspect of the world. So this is what we think the world should be focusing on, not only the IQ, EQ, but also focus on LQ, the Q of love. Because only when you care the others, only you care the others that succeed and more successful than you are, you have the chance. Ten years ago, internet was so good. No, when nobody believed internet was so good, now internet is so tough because all the smart people go to internet. So you should go to the off ground. I failed for funny things that I failed a key primary school test for two times, and I failed uh, like uh, two, three times for the middle school middle schools. No, oh, I, I tried. There's uh, examination that young people, if you want to go university, you have to taste take the examinations, so I failed three times. When I uh, graduated from universities, and before I, you know, for three years I tried to fill in the universities. So I applied jobs for 30 times, got rejected. I went for a police, they said, no, you're not good. I went to even the uh, KFC, when KFC came to China, come to my city, <laughs> you 20, 24 people went for the job. 23 people were accepted. I was the only one guy. <laughs> and we went for police. Five people, four of them accepted. I was the only guy that I rece received it. So to me, being turned down, rejected. Oh, by the way, I told you that I, would, I applied for Harvard for 10 times rejected. I learned so much about the Hollywood movies, especially the Forrest Gump. You love Forrest Gump. I love Forrest Gump. But why do you like him? Simple, never give up. Never give people, up. people thinking he's done, but he knows what he's doing. And I was very depressed the day, a year 2002 or three in the States. I was very depressed when I, I could not find out a way for the internet. And then I watched the movie in my friend's home, Forrest Gump. When I see him, I think, this is the guy we should learn from. Believe what you're doing, love it, whether people like it, don't like it, be simple. And like the word, life is like a box of chocolate. You never know what you can get, right? <laughs> I never know I would be here talking to you. I never know. But today I made it. I told my people in my apartment 18, 15 years ago, guys, we have to work hard, not for ourselves. If we can be successful, 80% of the young people in China can be successful. We don't have a rich father, powerful uncle. We don't have one dollar from bank, one cent from government. Just work as a team. I worry about it today, young people, a lot of young people lose hope, lose vision, and start to complain. Because I, we also have the same period. Because when I got, it's not a good feeling being rejected by so many people. We also depressed, but at least later we find that the world has a lot of opportunity. How you see the world, how you catch the opportunity. So, and the Hollywood gives me a lot of uh, inspiration. I, uh, at the beginning, I never thought, um, I, I thought when I was young, I said, everything's possible. Now I know not everything's possible. When you have something, you have to think about you have to consider about the others. You have to consider about the customer, society, your employees, your shareholders, so society. There are so many things that I think if you continue to work hard, there's, there's possibility. It's not amazing. If you don't do it, nothing's possible. If you try to do it, at least you have the hope. Calm down. There's always way out and keep yourself balanced. And meanwhile, don't try to, because business is, is a comp competition, is a fun. Business is not like a battlefield, you, uh, you die or I win. Business, even if you die, I may not win. Right, so it's about, it's about a fun. Yeah, tell them the story and tell them that if 
Jack, I, I don't think in this world there are a lot of people be rejected more than 30 times. <laughs> if we, you know, the only thing we never give up, the only thing like we're like a forest gun, we keep on fight, we keep on change ourselves. We don't complain. Whether you are successful or not successful, I find that one per people, when they finish the job, if they make the mistake, if they fail, if they always complain to others, this guy will never come back. If the guy only check himself, yeah, something wrong with me here, something wrong with me there, this guy has a hope. So many people I talked to at that time for Alipay, they say, this is the stupidest idea you have ever got. But I say, <laughs> I don't wear the stupid yeah. club as long as people use it. Now we have uh, 800 million people using this Alipay. 1999, year 2000, and even at the Yahoo time, a lot of people say, this Jack is crazy. He's, he's doing something that we don't understand. A lot of venture capitalists give you money because there is such a American model already there. But they say, Alibaba, we don't see this kind of model, right? They and say then, Jack's crazy. Is what yeah, this is a crazy guy. I mean, yeah. I remember my first time in Time Magazine, they call me Crazy Jack. And I, I think crazy is good. We are crazy, right. but we're not stupid. <laughs> <laughs> we know what we are doing, but if everybody agree with me, if everybody believe my, our idea is good, we have no chance. So that's the money we raised, we're very thankful. So when the, our investors make a lot of money, I feel proud and honored. Everybody is made in a unique and different. So you, you must have a unique and different way. Um, a lot of people today have a lot of complaints. Say, I don't have opportunity. I complained a lot when I was young. I suddenly realized complaint does not solve any problem. We're the opportunity always in the place where people complain. There are so many, if there are so many opportunities in the world, in this world, because there are so many complaints. <laughs> if you can solve the complaint, one of the complaints, that's the opportunity. So this is what we, we made. I think young people, if my advice to be an entrepreneur, don't be scared of failure or setbacks, and don't give up. When we start the business, we had 18 founders, including me, 17 of them, uh, most of them my students, and most of them, uh, well today people think these 18 people, the, the smartest people uh, in China. We don't think we are smart. Honestly, we all graduate from the very poor schools. Um, the only thing we did was that we are very united, we all believe the future, we are all optimistic, and we learn through mistakes. We never give up. If you graduate from famous university, please respect the people who graduate from the poor schools. Those people like us graduate from a poor universities, please respect yourself. We have chance. We came today to now, we made so many mistakes. People say, you are lucky. Yes, we are very lucky. We've been only 19 years to, to today's size. But we've gone through so many tough situations. We made so many mistakes that people cannot Im imagine, probably 90 years. You have gone through so many tough experiences. And that will make you different.